took care of the children in her class, but more than that, she took care of her eight nieces and nephews and everyone who was part of the family. She had wit, she had humor, she was the consummate educator. She researched everything very, very well. She was always thinking about someone else. They called her My Lily. Great nephews and nephews always called and reminded she always called them and reminded them about everyone's birthday, other members of the family too. She loved to dance and she could name just about any song. She always had the answer really for most everything. Family would call her up and, and she was like the computer with legs. She would always have the right answer. She uh, was anointed at Mercy Hospital in Merced on August 22nd, the day that she passed. She had received uh, the Teacher of the Year Award, the Association of uh, Two-Way and Dual Language Education. It was somebody at uh, Osborne Academy, the Facebook page. It's actually Executive Director Rosa Molina said Barron was always a warrior, an advocate for her children in the community. She was an amazing educator. She was so hardworking. She was such an expert in her craft. But even more important, she was a wonderful person and a good woman. Someone else said, she taught my sister all three of my brothers, and more recently my son, two years ago. She was an amazing teacher and will be greatly missed. And then the comments of the district superintendent who wrote, I am so sad to lose Lily. She'd been an icon at Osborne for so long that I cannot imagine the campus, her classroom, without her. I've always appreciated her candor the professionalism and humanistic approach 